Get off your ass and listen up. It's Big T with your Monday morning motivation. Hey, what's going on, guys? Big T here, the Big T Talks podcast. Here's a little uh, little Monday morning motivation for you. Get you started on this work work week. We are Monday, February 26th. Pretty sure this is the last Monday morning motivation of the month of February. So so hopefully it's a good one. Um, still getting over this uh, cold, man. My uh, nasal allergy, cough, shit's all sitting right in my head. So apologies for my voice. Apologies if I cough during this one, but uh, I just, I got to get it out there, man. I got to quit making excuses. Didn't drop any more this weekend just because I wasn't feeling it. But, you know, if I, if I just make another excuse of why not to do it, it's not going to get done. So, you know, apologize for how I sound, but here we go, man. Here's my question for you guys today. What is holding you back? What's stopping you from starting? Let's go back to that first one. What's holding you back? It's you. 100%. You are what is holding you back. Your thoughts and your beliefs and your excuses. That's what's holding you back. What's stopping you from starting? It's you. It's your excuses. Everyone's got them. I got them. We all have them. We all make excuses of why, why we can't. What's your excuse? I don't know what yours is, but I can list off quite a few. Most people, it's time. There's not enough time. I can't find time. I don't have the time to do that. I don't have the time to start this business. I have this project. It's a kick-ass project, but I don't have time to start it. That's an excuse. Money. Money's a big one. It doesn't stop you from starting it. You can still do all the research. You can still get it started. You can still get a game plan. Still get your goals. I mean, if you're not even starting it because you're using the excuse of money, then that's you. That's got nothing to do with anyone else. Your job? (coughs) Yeah, job's a big one. I mean, you know, you probably have bills. You probably have debt. That's another excuse. I can't do it because of my bills. Can't do it because of my job. Most people don't work more than 60 hours a week. And those are the people that are usually hustling. There's a lot more hours in the week than that. If you do a 10, 12 hour day, you're probably tired after work. I get it. But you're off a day or two a week. And there's time in the evening after everyone goes to sleep. You know, that's another excuse. Kids and family. I get a lot of my work done super early in the morning. I get a lot of my work done laying in bed on my phone after the wife has fell asleep. Just it is. That's you got to make time. If you're using any of those time, money, jobs, bills, debt, kids, family, it's all bullshit. Those are excuses. You got to figure out what's really holding you back without an excuse and it's you you are what is holding you back you are what is starting you from stopping i call bullshit on all of it we all have fear we all make excuses we're all scared it's how you deal with these that's what makes a difference how you deal with the fear how you deal with being scared how you deal with being frustrated That's what's going to make a difference. There's a bunch of things people tell themselves. A ton of things. (coughs) People tell themselves all kinds of things. You're not good enough. Bullshit. You are. I used to think I wasn't good enough. I still think I am not good enough. I'm still working on it. It's a work in progress. You are good enough. Here's another one. I don't know how. I don't know where to start. I don't know how. Bullshit. Research. Google. Books. Ask questions. YouTube. There's so, so many different resources out there that one, don't cost a dime. 
So money's out the window. Two, can be done when you're not at work in the evenings. So kids, family, and job, that's out the window. Again, it's free. The research is free. So bills and debt, it's not adding to your shit. It's out the window. So stop making excuses. So A, you are good enough. B, if you say you don't know how, that's a crazy excuse. Start. Do the research. Become the most educated person about what you want to do out there. Figure it out. Just figure it out. Should be a slogan. Next thing I uh, I wanted I had on there was time, which we talked about a little bit earlier. Time's bullshit. There's always time. I left 30 minutes for work this morning early so I could get in the car and record this podcast. Didn't want to do it at the house because the family was still sleeping. So I'm sitting in my car at the shop recording this episode. There's always time. Time should not be an excuse. Make time. And if you're worried about what your friends think, I hear that one quite a bit. Who gives a shit? They're obviously not your friends. Friends would support you. So friends would probably want to be a part of it or help you out or give you ideas. If they're not supportive, they're not your friends. You know, who cares if they make fun of you? Find new friends. You know, and if your family's not supportive, I get it. It's family. Prove them wrong then. Just don't bring it up to them. Just do it. Show them proof. It's, it's really that simple. Become your number one fan. Love yourself. Look in the mirror. What is holding you back? What's stopping you from starting? I don't know what it is for you. You know, get get a book. Get a journal. Get, get a notepad and start writing. You know, I'm working on a project right now called The Hustler's Notebook. And it's going to be for entrepreneurs to work through their ideas and set their goals. You know? It's, I do it every day on paper. I have notepads everywhere. Sometimes I lose those notepads. That's what I, that's how I came up with the idea of the hustler's notebook. So I could start logging all my stuff into one spot, a hardback book that I won't lose that will have, you know, tips and, and tricks in there and things to help you and inspirational quotes and sketch ideas and brainstorming sections, all kinds of stuff. It's still a concept, but guess what? <coughs> It was an idea. I put it on paper. There's nothing holding me back. There's nothing stopping me from starting. I started it. I've started the research. It's pretty simple. You need to be confident. Not cocky. There's a big difference. Don't be fucking arrogant. Don't be ignorant. Don't be a dick. Be confident. And knowledge. Knowledge is huge. Don't run your mouth and think you know everything. You don't know everything. We don't. I don't know everything. But I educate myself in topics that I'm interested in. So I do know. I don't know everything. But I'm confident and I'm not cocky. Alright guys. That's what I got for you today. Sorry about the voice. A little bit of fire for you. Monday morning motivation, February 26th. It's going to be a good week, man. Last week of February. Get out there, kick ass, crush it. Have a good one. Peace and chicken grease. Make sure you check us out on the YouTube channel as well. We're going to start dropping like a wake up Wednesday um, video. I'm not exactly sure how soon we're going to start it. I'm going to wait till I'm feeling 100% better. But it is coming. I bought the stuff to start recording video. You know, and that's one of my things. What was holding me back from starting the video? I was uncomfortable. I didn't want to be on camera. Didn't want a camera in my face. But guess what? I'm going to get over that fear. And I'm going to record and record and record and record myself until I'm comfortable. First ones might be shitty. Guess what? I don't care anymore. I'm going to build them until they are money. All right? Check us out on the web. Check us out on YouTube. Big T Talks. Have a good day, guys. Peace.